will end up doing the 10 a.m. spot, and that's I swear 100. percent I will be doing it. Yes, yeah. I'm gonna take all your some of your Next viewers away from you, uh, Miss Wood. JC says he's live now with 400 viewers. So no liar, <laughs> no he's not liar. Pathetic, pathetic. He's lost his uni then, hasn't he? <laughs> It is, he is, but, you know, uh, it's just pathetic, isn't it? Well, you know, and it, it's, it's embarrassing more than anything. But I, like I said, I'll speak about them as much as I can today, but tomorrow, that's it. I'm not going to speak about them once. Well, Eat just pancake, the go away. There's nothing wrong with Corey. And, and guys, don't even bother screen recording him. I mean, I, I send that one around because that was kind of quite bad, him telling to go some, someone about the bridge, you know what I mean? But I don't feel, well, listen, do what you want to do. I'm not going to control anyone, but... Don't even screen record them. Don't give them. Put them on there. He'll slowly die away. And Zach wants about. What's that, Capiche? I said what he said about jumping off the bridge was disgusting. Yeah. Hello, guys. I just wanted to let you all know I host a really amazing, funny breakfast show in the morning called The Big Breakfast at half seven every morning. Yes, okay. make sure you're there. You for it, Angela, Zach. put the Merlot down and tell them I'm what there I at half seven, Zach. Half seven. I want to take this opportunity yeah. to say I absolutely adore you. I love you too, Reesey Doll. You're I know amazing. you are. Good, yes, thank I've you. seen you in here before. Totally right, seven. anyway, half past and seven every morning, you. guys. I'm just pay, pay for a oh, promo. Yeah, yeah. All right, I'll do, this is for you, Angie. There you go. That's some promo money. Right, I love you all, guys. I'll see you later. Love you too. Bye. 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 Oh, bless yeah, as I was saying, I listen, I believe this is how to really honestly um, cancel, not cancel someone, but to, to push them off the kind of a little bit. The app is to stop screen recording them, stop putting them on the FYP, stop talking about them. I know I've stopped. I haven't stopped for the last three days, you know what I mean? Because it he hasn't stopped. But, you know, let him continue. In fact, I'm going to put his name in the period. And, that, and that's the only way to do it. And, you know, he loves it. FYP, he loves being spoken about. I know he's speaking about me now, you know, and who he was. And, you know, you know that's the only way. And EQ would say it. He, he talking about him is just giving him the views. And he's loving it. He's giving him attention. You're feeding him. Yeah, you're putting him on the FYP where people are going to go, oh, who's this guy? And they're, they're going to go yeah. and watch him. Do you know what I mean? Stop doing it. Stop talking about him. Stop screen recording him. Stop putting him on the FYP. He's just got him out. Black him out completely. Mm -hmm. the, I don't know how anyone can listen to him for hours. He's got the same monotone. Well, I know. It's just, <laughs> yes, that's true. Yes, that's not it? Makes my ears bleed. <laughs> he is a, he's a pure narcissist like Miss Wood. I mean, what are the traits, Kirpish, of, of a narcissist? What are the top five traits of a narcissist? Well, you need to Google that, okay, because it will tell you, okay? But they will never admit that they're a narcissist, number one. Okay. Uh, they will blame everything because they will never answer questions. And the terminology is flying monkeys. So it means it gets pe that, that they basically get people that think they're so brilliant and innocent under their control, basically. Um, and then they get them to do the dirty work for them. Yeah. Which is happening. Because let's face it, Pearl, all of them are doing all this dirty work for Miss Red. I'm sorry. Exactly. They are. Yeah. It's like she makes the balls of shit and gets them to throw them. And she Absolutely. knows how I feel about it. She put them in that barrel deliberately, hoping I was going to crumble, you know, because he went at yes. me for a year. And she did that on purpose, didn't she? And you yeah. held your own. Yeah. You kept so calm, and well, Tomorrow, guys, please uh, just respect me. We will not be giving him the, the oxygen, the clout, the views. No. You That's the best way to deal. Is, it is. Like that. With you on that one. Mm. Don't respond. Do not what? respond to anything. Yeah. Are we, block are we blocked to make comments as well, Ange? Yeah. I'll tell you what the f five traits are. Lack of empathy, need for excessive administration, yeah. ad administration. exploiting others, manipulative, attention-seeking, arrogance, dependency or neediness, envy, 
few boundaries, frequent criticism, lack of accountability, plays victim, sense of oh. entitlement, <laughs> arrogant and loud. <laughs> And you don't need to sound like a school report, Sianna. Sound like a what? Doing a school report. Reading out Alex Brigham's terminology. Look up the terminology of flying monkeys for a narcissist. Oh, I've got a sister-in-law like that. And you know what I always go find Capetius when he when he is live, he always wants that praise, you know, and she's a, she's very similar, always wanting to say big up to him and well done. Because he's always wanting that recognition, I help you with mental health, I do this, I'm a good person. You know what I mean? It's not something we all say about each other, is it? You know what I mean? And that's I, another I, one, and excessive importance. And yes, that's it, excessive yep. importance. And that's what he has, that he needs to feel important. That's it. Never That's admitting it. fault, controlling, identity disturbance, taking advantage of others. Yeah, and he and he does that because whenever, like when I was on the, doing the popular board, like, there was no competition. He made it into a competition, and I was getting people saying, "Oh, he's saying he's he's trying to you know get parties, you know that he passed me or something like that." All of a sudden, it became a competition. You know, using my haters to gift him. You know what I mean? He's actually manipulating his viewers to gift him. You yeah. know, They're the people that don't like me. That's another one, manipulation, Ange. Manipulative. Yep. Mm. I'm not doing it a popular board, Sue. I can't be asked with it. I've done it a, a couple of a few times, you know what I mean? I'm not even bothered with it. It sounds like you're all on that list as well. So it sounds like you're all your yeah, yeah. <laughs> shadow. <Shut up. laughs> No, he would say things like, oh, he's going to help my mental health. I, you know, when I was in the pub that time and I fell asleep under that tree and he said he's going to get off live, even though we're having beef, to see if I was okay. He never once sent me a message or phone me or anything like that. Not that I'd w want him to, but he made out to his viewers that he'd he done that and he didn't. Yeah, he plays the martyr to his yeah. viewers. Yes, yes. He's just sitting in my box all the time saying that he's check your phone, he's going to phone me, see if I'm okay, because, you know, I'd like to have a drink. To see if I'm okay. Not one phone call, not one message from him. The only time mm. I spoke on to about him on TikTok was talking about the box battles. Where he, I'd say, he would say to me, "You're going to do box. Why don't you do box battles?" I said, "Okay." And he said, "I." He goes, and he, he said to me, "Let's put me, you know, keep me in the box in the in the box battles, and I'll help you." You know what I mean? It was all about the Yeah. That's the only time he's ever spoken to me on TikTok, on the phone. It's like he latches yeah. on to people, doesn't he? He latches on. Mm -hmm. He latched on to you, he's latched on to Miss Red now. It's just, oh. just He wouldn't like, have a platform, would he? No. He, no. he wants, he's, gain, he's financially gaining from Miss Red. Because he's latched on to her. He, she's getting, he's probably getting some of her supporters. They're all fakers out. All of them. Well, when you think when I did that battle, I beat her the first time. She should have beat me because she gets 5k each day, each morning. She gets quite a lot of views, but a lot of these, I mean, when you think someone who gets 5k each day should be quite doing quite well on the leaderboard. She'll be doing well in gifts. I really agree. Good. Green blessings. Well, Angie, you have to remember, anyone who doesn't agree or has a different opinion is blocked straight away as well. So her block list mm -hmm. must be thousands long. So how is she getting those viewers as well? So it must be bots. I love. Sorry. That's very true. Views don't mean nothing. If you're not finan financially getting anything, and I don't mean to say this in a horrible way because I'm not honestly putting up about the money, but I'm just saying if you're not actually, and Eki will tell you this, she financially gains on TikTok. You know, she can walk away and, you know, make some money on here. You know, mm. if you're not making money, what have you what are these views are nothing. I'm not saying that for me because I just love chatting on here, do you know what I mean? But mm. they're quite obsessive with the views. The only reason I go on about it a lot is because I know what they're trying to do. They hate me because, you know, I have a nice community, you know, and they hate my... Uh, do you know what I loved yesterday? Every one of their chats had blue hearts put in it. Yeah. They hated it. <laughs> well, she hated that. And there's no point in her saying, oh, yous are all so nice to me, yous are all so nice, when she has the fucking sub only chat on. Of course they're going to be nice to her, they, they fucking sub to her. Turn off your sub chat and see how nice it is. There's a difference between EQ and I know that... And that's, that's, another, that's another way of making money, though, isn't it? Because everybody wants to see what she's got to say. So it's yeah. like, you have to subscribe so you can get in there to see what she's saying and, and, and actually make comments. 
Yeah, I'd rather give to EQ, which I have done, you know, because EQ will just come out with it. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> you know, I'd rather someone just say it straight up, like EQ, than someone being manipulative yeah. and manipulate the viewers by doing what she's doing. Do you know what I mean? Well, you know, and EQ does that. You know, she she always says, "Yeah, I make money on here." <laughs> you know what I mean? I financially get enough to well, come on, guys, send me the trains. You either do or you don't. But she's not manipulating. Choo choo, bang bang bang. Absolutely, and I love it because I send her trains because you know where you stand with her. She's open and honest about everything. And yeah, she was say it too. Listen, this is some things I don't con uh, condone, but neither would uh, probably you. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. So at the end of the day, I'd rather someone uh, says it to me than actually bloody uh, be on my back and just um, freaks me into gifting them. And she only retaliates when something's been done to her, to be honest. Yeah. That's my opinion anyway. I mean, I've had opinions on EQ. It's always been up and down, really. But I do take it with a pinch of salt. She's not someone. Can I? Do I really hate her, or have I hated her? Never, because I just take on a pinch of salt. Yeah, to be honest. And hate. Uh, hate's a strong word, anyway. Oh, there are some people I do hate. <laughs> well, there are a few people that I hate, you know. And I do hold a grudge, unfortunately. But that my nun brought me up, so <laughs> thanks, that, charming. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> uh, and that was upset to Donna. That's Charlie. Upset. Oh, upset Donna that uh, yes, in the line. But she you know, needs to realise she was also with EQ though. That's just what you said about her grandchildren. So, you know what I mean? She can't moan about that now. Well, anybody who's that though. But you know when everyone was going in Miss Red's box and saying about EQ when she was friends with her, saying how out of order she was, blah, blah, blah. Miss Red went, oh, well, that's EQ. Everybody knows what EQ's like. Now she's thrown it left, right and centre. What she said about my granddaughter. But you're friends with her. Yeah. Yeah. Really true. I mean, I don't know. Maybe sometimes I'm a little bit like that. You know, I think maybe a lot of people are a bit like that, you know. I happens. <laughs> Is my lens. Get in the box, you bitch. <laughs> Good afternoon, you boring bastards. Morning, Lins. You all right all afternoon, I should say. Where you been? You had day off and you've missed out all morning. Um, I've been on and off because I've been actually doing stuff. I've had to help my mum with stuff. Oh. So, uh, Put me in a care, though. I'm joking, you everybody. You're funny subjects, Lins. <laughs> joking. You are? You're talking about your funny subject, your favourite subject. I say favourite subject, you know what you were talking about yesterday. <laughs> oh shit, I was talking about it a lot yesterday, what was I saying? <laughs> yeah. Do you know what Miss Red is? On that lot. Oh, God, Miss Red. Yeah. Oh, is he still going on like? Uh, he was. I don't know about him. Oh, is that a stupid question? Yes, but you know, this guy never is never happy, you know, can you not just go live and have a laugh and chill out? You know, we all know, know. You know what he's doing though, don't we? He's always going at big creators to get a reaction to, to make, 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 make him a big creator himself, you know, by going, hoping they'll come in his box, hoping that he'll get a reaction and everyone's going to go, oh, who's Alex, who's this person, who's that person? Yeah. Oh God! I'm so you can be talking heard. about him now. It, it just it, it, block him out completely. Yeah, he's mm -hmm. feeding into it. Yeah, true. can we block? Put him in the keywords. He's yeah. already in there. Oh, is he? Oh, yeah. Oh, thank you. Yeah. And I put A B in there, so that can't be said either. I was going to say put his initials. He wants to replace Luke? Yes. Desperate to replace someone because he can't get his own platform. <laughs> Can I just ask Angie? Sorry, who is this Frankie? I don't know who he is, but from what I heard, it was disgusting what I heard him say. Is that his friend Frankie you're talking about? Yeah, whoever it was yeah. saying, Oh, he'd love to smash your face in. Yeah, and then to go and S U C K my dead father. Yeah, who That's is he? Um, Alex's friend. Because that, that's absolutely vile. To say that, it's disgusting. Yeah. And it's triggering for a lot of people. He went onto Miss Red's platform the, the day after to apologise to anyone that was affected, but not me. 
He said, I'm well, not well there you go then. So he should apologise to you after saying that. Yeah. He's, he's a cursed he, then. If he's apologising to other people, Ange, that just totally cancels out his apology because the person that he made the threat to was you. So regardless if he likes you or not, he should have at least apologised directly to you rather than, oh, anybody who's been to DV, I'm sorry. He said he was apologising to people, everyone that's been affected by me. That's but you, you know, it, he should apologise to you first of all and everybody else. Lynn's is right, absolutely, 100%. Yeah, and whoever said he's doing the school run bullshit. That's what I was about to ask. Like, I know that we're not supposed to like talk on. I'm talking about the parenting. Like, if he's got all of his time on TikTok, well, what does this kid do? Who Alex is? Yeah, he doesn't see his kid, man. I mean, I'm not getting involved in that because I don't know anything about that. So you know, I just want to stay. Because I don't know about I wouldn't, Kapesha, I normally wouldn't mention kids. Um, it's just the only reason why I continuously mention his kid for is because he was going around talking about mine, saying I'm not, uh, I haven't got a costume a kid. So that's why I, like, talk about him. Yeah, but that's what okay. someone said, he's going for a school run, but he doesn't need to go to the school. No, no, he's pretending now. <laughs> he's probably going to have some Oh, a pie. <laughs> he's probably still in the school room, but he's just probably perving around the school. No, that's so we can moan later that you've been, they've been talking about me, my, me and my kid again. <laughs> but Linz has got all right to moan about yeah, it because no, of what he's he said. Single. He's single. <laughs> <laughs> Angie, I'm going all out because I've had enough of that person, man. Like, so I don't give a shit now. <laughs> yeah, unfortunately, he did reproduce, Laurie. I don't know who the fuck laid down with him and opened the legs. <laughs> a horse. <laughs> oh, <laughs> or a pig. <laughs> no doubt I'll get a bit of backlash because I'm involved in this, but you know what? Bring on, I really don't care. I am in my am. I've got nothing to hide. I've been through worse situations than what that little clan can put me through, you know. Mm. Carry on, but I'll always stick up for Andrew, I'll always stick up for Zach. And again, I love him too. Not everybody does, but I do. I bet he were like a bouncy castle, I bet they'd have had to get on top. <laughs> <laughs> You know what? What do you mean? mean? We, we've we've resorted to this, but he's been he's been doing it for a very long time. Resorting to people's mental health, said that he doesn't give a fuck about Zach's mental health. You know, said you know, gone in on Zach when he's in, in, in his most vulnerable state. You know, gone in, going really a big time. You know what I mean? Still, and, and Zach's not talking about the guy. And Pearl getting exactly. his dad in is absolutely disgusting. I'm sorry, that is absolutely vile. That did have never happened, you know. Oh, yeah. the hell up! Because I've been through yeah. child. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, sorry, I don't know what this is. I think that I've come by accident. Well, it backfired on her, didn't it? Because now she's the most hated. Mm. The proper wrong and doing that. Like, why would you get like somebody on your show, on your show, on your live that literally like? talking about someone's childhood trauma like and it's his own father it's uh, i kind of put me kind of uh, i just don't know what to say about it honestly there's nothing you can say about it it's disgusting and that's it absolutely as horror. an ex foster child myself I, I literally felt for zach through the screen literally my heart broke for him Whatever he said about P, he said it to her on the live about her. What she did was beyond. Yeah, she's going on saying that he's been bullying her for over a year and stuff. Like, I haven't seen, like, nothing. Like, he's Polly's mentioned shit, what she's been doing on the FYP, but so does, so does other people. So she's making herself out to be this proper victim when Zach's fucking done Harley's nothing. He's just talked about our fucking behaviour. But hustle brought that to the, yeah, uh, not Zach, you know what I mean? Um, and I've mentioned the same mm -hmm. thing when she came for me, do you know what I mean? There was, a, there was an article in a newspaper 
You know, it shouldn't have come to this app. I don't agree with that either. But it wasn't him that did it. It was Hustle. And that's her arguing, you know, with him. Nobody knew about that until he brought it to the app. You know what I mean? No, so, at least why she's not going to hustle. Going for hustle for yeah. And listen, I don't agree with that either. Do you know what I mean? Hi, everyone. Hi, Naomi. Hi. Yeah, um, it was the Pearl and Zach thing that started. You know when she um, she said what she said, the racist stuff. Oh, the orangutan thing. Oh, yeah, wow. yeah, yeah. She um, rung Zach up saying, "Please, can you go on live and have my back?" Ra ra ra. And he did, but then he was like, "No, hang on a minute." He watched the video and he came back on. He said, "No, I can't do this." That's where it started between those two uh so because zach didn't do what he was told then yeah basically that is exactly it you got it lens that's it done wow so that wasn't that long ago so what does she talk about nine months ago when was it anyway when she said that night was it was this year march. wasn't it march march yeah, yeah. So it's, it's from march but it was she was really well, that's when she had her back up against Zach. Right. That's where it all started, wasn't it? Because that's um, he he did the right thing. He wasn't he wasn't um, going with the the click, and um, yeah, no, he said he said what he thought, and that's what he should do. He went to Miami in January, so it was after that. But anyway, I just wanted to put that point in because you didn't know. I just wanted to let you know that. All right, I'm dropping down. Yes. Can I just say, I know that what Zach said. Yeah. I know what Zach said as well. So don't, you know, um, she could have had a, she had a say on that. And that's where it should have stopped, really. You know what I mean? Well, that's what it is, Ange. People are obviously I done lives on about what Zach done. In and she, will, she won't stop. She will go in. You know what I mean? I mean, listen, I've mentioned it for the last few days because I, I had PTSD from, you know, a certain individual on it. <laughs> <laughs> you know? Um, I'm going to also get someone in a box because of them two women that so she was scammed. Didn't they even pla pill platform them two women as well, didn't she? What you that, uh, that was saying that Zach like scammed them or something scammed them was it michelle her name or something i don't know so that's twice yeah. his platform people to try and bring him down i like you're right angie she just doesn't know when to stop her like does she like because she's got nothing else to talk yeah. about on her fucking lives apart from beef we're sitting here minding my own business just having a chat sometimes and you know drunk and she'll be questioning me or talking about me Oh, I'm not her. Mama to make content for herself. Mm -hmm. I've always said it though, like that's how she's known on the app. She always used to do battles and then get him like CLA and she used to kick off and cut like just be horrible to like CLA, CLA, EQ, you know, like all the big creators. And then she just started like getting noticed from there. So that's how she started on the app. Mm. Wow. Has Zach even paid all this money back and they're still at him? Mm -hmm. And women, I just don't understand it. But what sort of platform have you got if you're going to platform people to try and bring people down? It's just a hate campaign. It just takes it to another level altogether. Mm. Yeah, because um, she didn't Red have to put a, um, a live on Subchat because everyone was spamming the thing with blue hearts for Zach. Yeah. So did P as well. <laughs> she was doing polls, Lynn's, but um, her subs were going against her. <laughs> really? Yeah. I went in on my other account, but she blocked me. I only put blue hearts in comments. Oh God, I, can't, I honestly, like, this is not just me, like, seeing it because obviously th there's been a fall, like, but I can't stand, like, red, like, she's just so fucking boring and, fe mm. like, you can just tell her fear, I can smell her fear from a mile off me, like, I swear to him. Mm. When she was swigging water from that bottle, it, it went because she'd had medication or she had a dry mouth, she was nervous, she was lying every time she pulled a lie, she had a swig of it, 
and her voice tone changed as well did anybody notice that because I do, it was just so funny because I was working yesterday, right? You know, like when I had like the time to like look on my phone for like about a minute, I swiped onto hers, then I swiped onto you. It was like she was just fuming and then Angie's just like, dee dee dee, <laughs> like didn't give a fuck. I was hurling. Oh, you'd have been proud of Angie. She was brilliant. <laughs> I've seen some screen recordings. The coming, the coming box for battle and she was like, we're having a great morning. We're having so much fun. And and Red's got a face like thunder. <laughs> Angie, I've, I've never seen that. I've fixed it not in my life. Honestly, oh, that was hilarious. And the classic line, Angie, you deserve an Oscar for this. When Red said, um, you said, oh no, well, hang on a minute. Red said, yeah, well, we all, we all, you always want to win, don't you, Angie? You, you always want to be a winner. You're a winner, Angie. And you went, yeah, it's just, you're a loser. And he just, <laughs> it just flowed brilliantly. It really did. I I not heard of when that happens because you really put her in her place. She oh, was no. she was fuming. Mm-hmm. Yeah. yeah, and then she was trying to like put slide digs in, saying, drinking at ten o'clock in the morning. Let's put red red wine on. Then Angie's just singing yeah. along the red red wine. <laughs> yeah, she was. <laughs> and that annoys me, you know. Yeah. You're just trying to prod her just to get a reaction. Well, it's mocking. It's, uh, it's not just mocking Angie. You know, it's mocking a lot of survivors. Absolutely. People that haven't even made it through it, unfortunately. Yeah. They're not being able to get uh, sober. And those that are struggling to get sober. Mm, definitely. Now, to tell you about my story, I did slightly this morning, but, you know, my story, I'm seven years sober. Oh, well done. Oh, that's dead good. Brilliant. But, you know, it, it's mocking it. It's just mocking it. It's disgusting. Mm. Mm. Definitely. We don't drink just because we want to drink. We drink because there's a reason why we used to drink. There's mm. a reason why we do drink. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's it's different for everyone, isn't it? You know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. Well, Red's no morals. She don't care about anybody. She's not got a kind bone in her body. I'd love to shove that water bottle down her throat, to be honest. Yeah. <laughs> She's all, it's all me, me, me. Mm. Yeah. But yeah, you but know, not, not she was smoking yeah. yesterday. She was so stressed. Was it yesterday? She was yeah. so stressed. The amount, of, the amount of Mayfair blue she had. <laughs> <laughs> and then she got flagged and then she got banana, didn't she? Yeah, brilliant. <laughs> Oh, yeah, she did. And I got yeah. down from that. Oh, I didn't tell anyone to report me. No. Somebody, somebody said, oh, her internet's gone. And then all of a sudden, it live ended, didn't it? Mm. What account's she on now, then? She's got it back. Oh. Red, oh, yeah, she got it back. I'll get it back within the day. Don't you worry. Oh. No, you've got a 24 hour ban, Red. Stop lying. <laughs> <laughs> Still appeared in Populars though, didn't it? But not as high as um, our Ange. <laughs> I got my first banana last night in a while, Ange. Oh. <laughs> I'm not surprised, to be honest you with you. To... You was funny last night, though, didn't When you kept coming up, you were saying a bit more about him. Then he went down, then he come back up. <laughs> <laughs> I loved it. So funny. Mm. I don't understand why people even watch it, to be honest with you, because um, I get bored. And listen, I'm not saying people people might get bored on mine, you know what I mean? But I just don't really get it how she gets that many viewers. I'm sure it's definitely because it's a 10 a.m. spot, so it's a good spot to have, because in the afternoon she only gets about 2K. Because when she right goes, first time with Bob Sanj. Yeah, I mean, I, you know, I, there's no point watching her at 10 because it's all about herself. Might as well start watching her at 11. <laughs> definitely. On the old bots, yeah. Do you know what else makes me laugh? She doesn't come on in an afternoon, but just later she can come on. I think it's for the money, for the gifts. Mm. She never comes on. Of course it is. I wonder if she's paying her tax and all. Red. Yeah, more like it's Christmas coming up and all that lot, begging. And what happened to her staying on all day yesterday? (laughs) I think she just went defeated off Ange. Mm. (laughs) I mean, when did this tax stuff come in? Is it the end of the month or when's it all started? Because there'll be a lot of people in a lot of trouble. Mm. 
Yeah, and yeah, like when you come, yeah, Angie, you always used to come on like early, like a while ago, like over a year ago. Can you remember? Yeah. I like it when Angie's on in the morning. I'm doing the school run and that and getting sorted for work, but it's nice to have you on in the background. Mm. I always have it on in background, it doesn't matter what I'm doing, even when I'm driving. I just look at my screen, I can hear you all. I know, I think Angie sees me more now than what my husband does. <laughs> <laughs> well, on my iPad, I'm in this account, and then on my mobile, I'm in another account um, because that's my spying account. <laughs> <laughs> So if I commented, you wouldn't know it were me. <laughs> but no, I'm spying on us. I'm spying on others. <laughs> when you were doing them back... Oh, uh, Ange. Sorry, Lens, go on. Uh, I, know, I was just saying, Ange, um, Ange, I had to, like, top me um, two of my Snoopy accounts up, because, well, my Snoop accounts, because, you know, when you were doing the um, the popular the other day, I was like, I need to get the heart maze in. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah, my finger was aching that day. It was like heart, 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 heart. Yeah, I have a gift enough both. <laughs> you need to change your target as well, Ange, because it still goes. So you still, you still targeting no, for I'm not I don't do the bot popular. It was just that once when that same create person wanted me yeah, yeah, yeah. in competition. Yeah. Yeah. The pathetic outlet. Let me get on with it, you know what I mean? That's why I say, because I'm eating a minute, like, every, every, put my views every day for this, you know what I mean? Hmm. Wow, it's Luke Lately like Angel's ain't not been on. Luke, no, he's just good. I don't know where. Don't blame them, like, considering the raggedy dolls are um, going down. They're not well liked. We need, right, someone to go live at 8 and then someone to go live at 10. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? <laughs> to, to, to kill two birds with one stone, take them both. <laughs> Lins, why don't you go Fair live? <laughs> you are? Why don't you go live before you go to work? Ah, uh, I can't, because uh, I've got to do the school run and then I've got to, like, start working off nine most days. Mm. So I go straight to the school run, straight to, straight back home to do my work. Shit. Yeah. Do you work from home as well? Yeah. Yeah, me too. I do like it, though. I wouldn't think I would even have the attention span to do, like, FYP, because... Like, see, Ali, having that, uh, like, I'm not bothered about them, like, the borers, do you know what I mean? Talking about them all the time would be, couldn't be yeah. honest. Mm. We need Zach on at eight and, and Ange on at ten, need for Sprouts, right? Yeah, fill in the gaps, Ange, fill in the gaps, mind. Yeah, come on. <laughs> Absolutely, yeah. I do watch Zach in the morning, but I do flip between Angie and Zach when Angie comes on. Yeah, I watch oh. Zach half seven to eight and then I flick on to Angie and then I'm just sat here all day. <laughs> Don't move. I, I think, Angie, you need to get a 10 o'clock spot. You really do. Yeah, I think I probably will. It's just I just don't... Um, I just go eight, generalised, um, so that threaten doesn't get the news. <laughs> mm -hmm. But you've got enough supporters and enough lovers that you could do it. Definitely. Yeah, but who's going to do the eight? Zach can do it. Why can't Zach carry on doing it? Because Zach, I love Zach. He starts at half seven, but he's already on at eight, so he could run it right through. Yeah. Yeah. That's true. Even if you come on at half nine, Ange, and did a warm up and then started your FYP at ten. Yes. <sighs> We I reckon you should do it, Ange. Say morning to everybody. Sorry, Lind. Ah, no, I'm just saying, Ange, I think you really should do it, you know. I think it'd be good. I think all your supporters should go and support Zach, and then Zach can support, support you. you. want to do is get a laptop and do the, you know, the, the studio. Oh, yeah. God knows how to set that up, eh? Well, I can't ask me. I've got a fucking spell work TikTok. <laughs> Well, Angie asks that because he does it. He'll be able to help you. So we'll give you a little online class through Teams or something. Mm. Yeah. 
you could take this over and you really could. Especially if you and Zach work together. It's not that I even want to. I just, just, do you know what I mean? It's just because of the situation. Do you know what I mean? As to what they're doing. The no, viewers are asking for it, Ange. The viewers are asking for it. Yeah. yeah. And also, yeah. it gives you a Angie, rest in the morning. Sorry, Lynn. Mm -hmm. Sorry. I was just saying, Ange, because the, there is a demand for it, because I think, like I say, Red, like she's just falling apart because everyone's starting to realise how fake she actually is. Do you know what I mean? There's only so much excuses and people covering for her, like, before people actually think, fucking hell, you really are fake. Like, if people don't see it already now, like, you need your head checked. Mm. Yeah. At least for you, you're real, like, and you see it how it is. I'm not being funny, but they deserve it. After everything they did when your man was poorly and all that shit, mm -hmm. and the blackouts and shit trying to do on you, that if anyone deserves it, they deserve it. And if you and that work together, it it mm -hmm. like it come a force. Angie, do a vote. Should you do ten a.m. Go okay. on. The happy face, yes. Sad face, no. Oh. Is anybody not interested in co-hosting with me, though? I get a bit bored sometimes. I'm not going to lie. You crack me up. That's my problem, that, you know. You always I do, get in, but, you know, I, I'm just I'm happy. I'm just going to like, then some days I can just lay in, do you know what I mean? And then, like, Linz or whoever just takes over, you know what I mean? Oh, Charlie, what about Charlie or Corey? I don't think Corey would be up at that time. It'd be nice to have a, like a co-host that can play the video. Feel the same, the wrench. Huh? Won't feel the same. Oh yeah. You've got to do it. Yeah. yeah. Mm. If anyone's going to do it, and it's going to be you. Mm. Look at the vote. Look at the character. <laughs> yeah. Personality to do it. You could have your days where you don't want to do a four P. You just want to get people in the boxes and have that. That don't have to change. Yeah, yeah. like an open live. I mean, when you think yeah. about people that she's probably blocked, you know what I mean? They've got nowhere to get. You know, nothing. No one to watch. No. Nope. <laughs> like you said, nobody's tied to ten a.m. slot, so no stops you from. Like I say, coming on at half nine, doing your warm up, morning everybody, or doing a bit of music, and then starting off work here at ten. You know. Yeah. I never could. I could find like a co-host for days just when I can't do it. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, or, yeah, yeah. Well, I'm gonna have a day off today, so that would be kind of nice. So and we can keep it consistent. Yeah. Definitely. I did say I said Jack could do it at 10 a.m., but I think he's happy with the, with the 7 a.m., yeah? Because mm. I'm not interested about doing it because, you know, because of uh, views, money, or anything like that. None of that. It's just because of the situation that what they're doing, do you know what I mean? That's the only reason I do the 10 a.m., because they're pissing me off. Mm. Mm. They're me just down. really biased. They take me down doing these blackouts on me and using a platform to fully... Like, because so obviously the, yeah. Sorry, the piggy boy one, like he literally uses the FYP as an excuse to talk about you. Yeah, like, like you see, Ange, yeah, you're on the FYP, fair enough, if he wants to have like an opinion on whatever you've been doing, but it drags on for like a full two hours. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah it's not just uh, an hour, is it? Yeah, I think I said to Zach, I think mean, you should do the 10am. I think he said like, no, he wants, to, he wants to keep to that his time. Do you know what I mean? Because I think he would do very well at the time. It's such a trigger, Ange. I don't know why he replays your videos and talks about you. Exactly. You've mm -hmm. no brains, honestly. Mm -mm. I mean, I telling someone to go and jump off a bridge was disgusting. He needs to try it himself. I probably shouldn't have said that. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, I've just realised what you said. <laughs> Sorry, I forgot we're on here. We're just thinking out loud. <laughs> I wonder if he needs a push. You <laughs> said it out loud again, that. Nana. I think it's the end of talking. What me? What me? <laughs> 
Do you know what it is, Angie? Like, it's not me, like, because I have, like, I... What's that, Nando? I was just going to say, if you don't know what that person's situation is, you know what I mean? You know, whether they, they could be under crisis team, they could, you know, be feeling that way, you just don't know, do you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. What was that, Nando? Right you could not... I was just going to say, Angie, like, I, like when you had the beef for them like i literally used to bite my tongue all the time like i used to kick off sometimes but now i'm just thinking like you get called for it anyways you get called like a wrong and whatever so i might as well just fucking let loose and say what i want about them do you know what i mean well they don't all back to the lines exactly so what were you saying to people? oh I, I was just saying you know auntie's right you don't know what what he said right to that lady, you do not know whether she's under crisis at the moment. You do not know. You know, what's going to happen? Do they need blood on their hands or something when it, until it stops? I mean, is that what they want? Blood on their hands? I'm I used to not bothered about that. I mean, look what they've done to Zach. What if he'd have harmed himself? They won't exactly. be bothered of the effects of it and how it can... And he's already in a dark place but let's just push him a bit more. You know, it's, yeah. it's evil. Yeah, because I think that comment didn't even say anything bad to him. I think they just said, oh, you're obsessed with Angie or something, and then he just come out with it. Vile. Mm. Like when she said, imagine if Angie said it. Oh, my God, you've triggered everyone, Angie. You disgrace. Mm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It rolled off his tongue, didn't it, Lola? Oh, this is what I've been trying to tell you for a year. He's playing you guys. He doesn't care. You know, they he accuse you of all this behaviour. Sorry, I'm still interrupting. They accuse you of all this behaviour, but they're going in deep, doing worse. I'm sorry. What they're doing is victimising you. They're all gunning for you. They're all bullying you. And it's not right. I'm sorry. Yeah. 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 But we'll always fight your corner. Yeah. Oh, no conscience at all. Yeah, because so, that's what I mean, like, he just needs to constantly, he needs constant validation. He always needs to remind people how much of a good person he is and how, how he's never violent or swore at a woman disrespectfully. Just because you haven't, well, you have actually told me to fuck off. So I might be the first one on TikTok. But, like, the way he was acting with Angie last year, like, that was a lot worse than telling someone to fuck off. How many people were you affected by putting my face, Charlie's face, on bloody sex offenders? Exactly. Well, I keep going on about that, but it's, guess what? It's affected me. It's somewhat. Well, can I just say something, right? Okay, so this thing about putting you on Jimmy Savile's face, the dirty, mm -hmm. or I can't even know. But, right, that's just happening. It's all because you, st it, it, uh, correct me if I'm wrong, is to do with the stem of somebody that you had on your live and people are trying to ask questions okay no because he no, because he did he did that before all of that happened he said he started he'd done that a long time ago i've got wow. the dates so okay. before i put anyone on my platform who was doing that so that's his excuse now but that's sick you don't even put uh, someone on uh, gary glitter jimmy snabble this said something about p diddy to me you know um me jeffrey dharma Jeffrey Dharma, yeah, it's weird. You know, and you might think it's oh, it's funny, it's not, but you know, it's, it's you not got victim. Mm. Look, I'll, 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 I mean, I'm quite, a, you know, I'm not going to go into details, but I'm also someone that has suffered from CA. Mm. So what he's doing, and what, it's disgusting. I'm sorry. That's an safety trigger yeah. for people that have had sex. It's not okay. Absolutely. He's making a mockery of the whole situation. But yet he's got like women in his life like, oh yeah, sorry if I'm triggering you. I'm sorry if Angie's triggering you. But yet you're literally mocking like SA victims or survivors. Do you know what I mean? Yeah. It's not excuses for like, everything, Lynn. Mm. God. Yeah.
Someone was saying yesterday, I don't know who it was, it was just a... It was just a video of Flick Through Ange and the said... Yeah, Frit yet, Lindsay said... Am I wavering in What about that um, video, um, Lens, of him? Yeah, I think you are, yes. Do you want to jump out and jump back in? Oh, God. <laughs> what video, Ange? Yeah. I'm saying, oh, it's only because it hasn't gone that far. Uh, it's only because of me it hasn't gone that far for you, Ange. You know what mm -hmm. I mean? It could have gone a lot further because I know a lot of people on here. If you if you don't think I know people on here, then you're you're it's something we said. Do you know what I mean? I, I thought was like, hey, threatening me. You know what I mean? What kind of man is yeah. I've got food on my face. He always he always used to act like Al Pacino, like yeah, and um, it can get a lot worse if you keep going on. I can do a lot of things, but I, he said that a good few times, Angie. Like some gangster. <laughs> I don't know who done the video, and I didn't watch till the end of the video. But I, heard, I think you did sound like that, Miss Baguette's voice. But they said he needs a finger check because, a like a device check, because what would we have to have searched to find pictures of them people, and do they the AI things that he does? Like, what would he have put in that bar to get all that picture up in the AI bars and stuff? I think he just Googles Jimmy, doesn't he? When he just Googles Jimmy Savile for photos. And just yeah, or do you know when he does his AI photos? Yeah. Like Corey's one that had what rent boy on it or something. You're having to put all that into your AI thing to make these pictures. And what I don't realise is all these searches are saved as well. They're all in his history. Angie, Kerry said, will you check WhatsApp? Yeah. Um, I'm sick. Sorry. He will, uh, I don't know. Um, yeah, it doesn't insult Al Pacino, like. <laughs> <laughs> so, he literally he's... thinks he's part of the Mexican cartel and that man, like, piss off, you're on TikTok, you're wet white with no neck. But what worries me, he's so adamant about, you know, when Angie said about the dark web and things like that, right? So he's adamant that he only looks up you know, th things about hidden bunkers and, you know, the the true facts you get about, um, you, you know, there's, apparently there's a hidden bunker in Alaska and all of that, all this conspiracy stuff. But we don't know what else he's doing on there. Yeah, yeah. what if he's searching up hidden bunkers in England or wants to hide someone in there? Well, it, don't you know, you just scared me now. <laughs> I mean, there's plenty of hidden places in, in oh, as well, but, you know, it's just, well, what else is he on there for? Yeah, definitely sounds creepy, that does. That sounds worse, then. Mm -hmm. He was talking about my relationship earlier, saying, yeah, he's just using you for a phone card. He's probably sleeping with loads of women. I mean, he's slamming women as we speak or something like, and I'm like, oh, why do you have to sexualize everything? Like, do you know what I mean? I couldn't give two shits, to be honest. At least I've got a relationship, Alex. Whether he's cheating or not. Because he's got the audacity to accuse my partner of cheating, right? When he's the one that was sending his winky around the TikTok app, like he's a cheater. <laughs> like... Piss off. Well, you know, I'm newish to TikTok, but I, I, I could call them all out straight away. Don't know all the backstories, but I can call them out straight away. I'm a 47-year-old woman. I've been through hell and back, and my life revolves around adopting cats. <laughs> and you love that. Well, at least you're doing something positive and do you know what I mean? Like you're not, I don't know, like some people on this app. It's toxic, this app, I'll be honest with you. It really is. you got... Definitely. It is. But I know who I will support and I know who I will be strong for and I know who I can't stand and I'm quite happy to speak up. Bring me on a live with him, because I'll rip him to bits. I'll probably get bananas, but, you know. <laughs> Just come on a backup account, Capiche. <laughs> I, I don't even know how to do it. Do you ever go live, Capiche? 
No, because I, I don't even know how to work TikTok, to be honest with you. You should make another account and then come into Andrew. Well, Andrew will get all your followers and then come in on that account so you don't lose your main account. I don't even know how to create another account. I'm not very good with technology. <laughs> You're like me. <laughs> I keep going over in that PLM server and they've got like a big Discord. I'm like, I do, I do have a Discord, but I don't know how to work it. <laughs> I'm not in any server, do you know what I mean? I've got mods and I don't know if they know, but I wouldn't have a clue, man. I mean, if anybody... Well, I wouldn't know how to mod. I also forget to go on the Discord, me. <laughs> I wouldn't know how to do anything. I'm just about to deal with, you know, talking to you on a live. I mean, I'm, I'm quite happy that I have to figure that one out. <laughs> You know, I, I'm not very tech savvy, and I, I've got, I'll be honest with you, quite open about my alcohol abuse that I went through and everything, but I've got peripheral neuropathy because of the alcohol abuse, um, you know, although I'm seven years sober, but my fingers don't work properly, my mind doesn't always work properly, my legs and my feet don't work that properly, because the peripheral nerves fire off all the wrong messages again yeah me friends got that yeah it's horrific mm, yeah. do you feel better now though seven years being seven years sober but my liver is damaged i'm quite happy to talk about this i've got no shame my liver is damaged it will always be damaged but the liver is a great thing so it does repair itself yeah. But I've got scarring all over the liver um, and I'm at higher risk of liver cancer. So I have to have an ultrasound every six months. Um, there's a lot of issues that come with alcoholism, a hell of a lot. You know, you can get dementia from it. Mm -hmm. uh, you have to take thiamine. You know, I have to take three yeah. thiamine a day. Her piece, you know, like, because my friend, like, she was in hospital for months and months, like, due to the alcohol, and she's been off it, like, a full year, like, yeah. but she's got, like, really bad anxiety because, you know, like, she was, like, always under the influence all the time, and yeah. now she's, like, in reality, and, like, obviously, if she has another drink, like, she'll be unalive, basically, she's at that point, so she's yeah. finding, like, like, a whole new world because, obviously, she was drunk for so long, do you know what I mean? Yes, I get it, and she needs support. Is she getting support? Is she in a support group? It I think she's got a weird for, um, therapy in that. It doesn't have to be AA. I mean, like, AA is brilliant. It's all over the world, you know. I didn't get on with AA. But where I am, there's local things that doesn't involve, you know, God and your higher power and things like that. But it's great, and it's. And she needs to be in a support group. She needs to be uh, a trained expert. And I'm not talking textbook experts. I'm talking people that have gone through it to support her until she gets what she needs, which is the proper therapy. But also, she needs to find things that are going to. Um, Take her time up, if that makes sense. Other things that she likes doing. Because you are describing yourself. Mm. That's all I can say, you know. I mean, I'm, I'm only going from my story. I'm not an expert. Mm. But if she wants to speak to me, I'll quite happily speak to her. Oh, I think you're all speak to her. I've introduced um, Angie to her. She sometimes comes and watches Angie's live. <laughs> Oh my God, it's your new drink. <laughs> <What's that? laughs> no, I don't know what you said about Ange. She was like, yeah, hey, I do like that Ange. Like, she's proper, like, um, like, straight to the point and, like, doesn't fuck about. <laughs>